Greetings and salutations. So we're back in Imperium Galactic Survival. And this is really just kind of a status update. So I'm in my solar farm. This was really the first one that I had built. I I haven't implemented some of the newer models or the newer versions in, into the the persistent universe you know this the uh survivor game and it does look like they've fixed uh the issue that i was having is a lot of stuff was decaying and uh it does seem that a, a lot of that stuff has been addressed um see so i've been i kind of log in periodically and just try to uh keep keep the the farm cranking out packs now one of the issues that i've run into though is a while back there were some bugs where stuff was disappearing and so like the secondary base that i had right here you can see where my my ship um was right there i had set a waypoint to it well so all all of this stuff out here disappeared but for whatever reason the ship that i'm on didn't disappear so i don't i don't know why that took place <laughs> but so i'm basically stranded now uh out here in the universe with my solar farm so i can eat myself to death i can be like the 1200 pound you know homer simpson out here just stuffing mres um and i built this thing kind of with like a lot of air um so if i go here if i hit f4 i kind of forget the hotkeys periodically because it's uh it's it's so different from some of the other titles that i play but uh, let's see, I want to go systems. I've forgotten, forgotten how to. Uh, is it F? I think it's F. I think F is what I was looking for. No, I can't remember. It's always. Uh, I think it's this. No, no. I have forgotten. I forgot how to look at the ship. The ship. Uh, I'm just going to press keys until I get it. I know it's got to be. There's B. You can tell there's how the player base is really cut off. Um, is it I? No. I is my inventory. No. Tab. I have completely forgotten how to, um, in third person. Wow. It's been so long. There's the ship. So anyways, kind of what I wanted to do is, you know, I've pre-manufactured a bunch of stuff in here, but I haven't put it out into the world. And I can, you can see that most of this stuff, um, it says that, that some of the stuff is still in the game, but I don't know where it is at. Sunset, oh, these are, these are actually stuff that I've cored and taken over, which is funny. And then there's the solar farm. Um... But you can see that most everything has disappeared in, uh, let me see, if I can do ships, it doesn't let me do ships there. If I do ships here, and uh, let's go through, let's see what we have here. Okay, it looks like we have the two that I cored. For whatever reason, they're, they're still, you know, so I, all the ships disappeared. Let's go to bases. And let's see what we have for bases. And I don't know why this stuff. Okay, so it looks like we do have spires. Um, if it's MCRN, it's mine and not and that Sandman. So let's see here. Okay, Elite Moon. So some of the a lot of the teleporters stayed around. Okay, it looks like. Uh, Yep. Okay. Let's see what we got here. There we go. See, so, okay. So we got a solar teleporter. So some of the solar teleporters stayed around. Let's see. Uh, Skywatch Station, 266 kilometers away. So that's still there. Um, but it's just, so the issue that I'm having really is that if I go here and look at the map, you can see I'm on I'm on uh, one of these kind of like uh, satellite galaxies and uh, info panel. 
one of these satellite galaxies. And, um, yeah, I, I have no way to get off of this thing. And I don't know how to do this, you know. And I'm at the Mel Melfihide, uh, you know, and see where, see where I've just researched. I mean, I've just gone through and explored all of this stuff. Uh, I think I've, I've visited quite a few galaxies as I've kind of gone through here. And I've I even teleported all our put solar panels, our uh, solar teleporters, and linked all these these constellations. Let me do the color uh, territories there. Where it makes it a little easier to, to you know, where I've I've daisy chained all of this stuff together all the way, even up here. I guess the issue though that I'm having is um, I wonder if I can click this and then go right into the system. That's a G G Tito or whatever. So let's see here. Uh, let's find G Tito. Let's see if this has still got a teleporter. Yes, yeah, so it says there's a teleporter still there. So maybe maybe all I need to do is just throw down one of these solar teleporters that I built, and that'll be uh, one of my one of my solutions. And I don't know why all that other stuff disappeared, but I've I've kind of been just oh it all died. What happened? All my shit just died. What happened? What happened? I don't know. I have power. Oh, I pressed, oh, I just killed off all my shit. I pressed power and I just killed off all my shit. Oh, I was going through, I was going through the, uh, I couldn't remember what, how did I do that? What did I do? Oh, I just killed all my crops. Oh, it just died so fast. I don't, I don't know what happened. Oh, look what I just did. I just killed off my entire solar farm. Ah, oh, I just turned the power off for like two minutes. And it just killed everything. How did I do that? What, what button did I press? What was that? Uh, I've forgotten all these hotkeys because I really haven't been playing too much because everything disappeared. And uh, which one was it? Okay, there's T. Was it F4? No. Yeah, that's horrible. One of the things that I would I would like to see is, um, you know, this 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 um, you know, they have this engineering tree, and and I'd like to see some of the recipes come from. Um, man, I I've, I've completely forgotten how to do these hot hotkeys. Uh, you know, I've been playing a lot of Seven Days to Die, and their POIs are so much better. Their POI layout is, uh, man. What did I do? Was it P? Oh, there's, that's what I was looking for. Fuel. Why is, oh, yeah, because it. My solar. What the hell? Statistics. Um, this thing is a solar. Okay, solar. Yeah, solar right there. I would like to see this uh, this battery displayed um, here. I would like to see this battery displayed somehow tied into this to where. I could, the solar fuel could be extracted from, um, from this. So if I have a bunch of solar stuff on here, I could uh, slowly leach off that solar battery power and use it to fuel my ships and somehow kind of rework this fuel cell component. Um, I've forgotten what the hotkey. I was, you know, another thing, if I mouse over this, um, it should give me my corresponding, see, it says power, um, fuel. Because if I run, if I run the, well, that runs the generator. Okay, never mind. But yeah, I'm, I'm not doing too good in the game. I'm definitely not. Do, what did I press? That's, the, that's what I don't get, is what did I, 
that's the flashlight. What did I press to to kill my power on here? I don't realize that I didn't realize that I had turned the power off. Ah, I press Y. Y did it. Oh man, I just bo I just boogered myself up. I don't think these I don't think these crops should die as fast as they did for just cycling the power off. I just can't believe how quick those things just completely died uh, for turning off the power because it's still the atmospherics would have remained constant even if I turned the power off for 30 seconds or 40 seconds. Um, wow, I've had I've had these things going in here now for like two months or something. Let's let's see if I go back to map. And then I look at the info info pan, panel because I discovered this this place. Uh, does it not give me? Does it not give me uh, my info panel? Usually it says discovered by. Okay, well I guess I guess it's given rocket. So I discovered this. You can see here I discovered this on. Um, uh, Wow, that, that date doesn't correlate to <laughs> that date doesn't correlate to um, ten twenty three. So what's the current date? I guess that's the question. Is what's the current star date? Hmm. Yeah, I'm not doing too good. Kind of wish you could send out an SOS signal uh, and have kind of a little bit of an a, a, a mechanic. To where you could do it, um, man. I boogered myself up. All right. Well, I think. I think. Uh, I don't know. I kind of feel like I need to do a restart. And if I, even if I were to suicide, um, I can't get off. You know, I can't. I can't. Uh, I can't get off. Get myself a restart on a planet, which I don't think I necessarily should, but. Um, You know, I gotta figure out how to get myself off, how to get myself off this thing. That's that's the challenge. I gotta figure out how to get myself off of this um, space station because um, all my stuff disappeared, and it's weird because some stuff in other galaxies didn't disappear, but um, it definitely. I don't know. But I enjoy the game. I think it's a fantastic game. I'm just kind of stuck, I guess. I don't know what I want to do. I, I ran into an issue where all the all the planets that I visited, I, I really, the POIs were kind of lackluster or dated. And they really just, they needed a lot more complexity and depth. And, uh, you know, for the energy that it took to get there and the resources and the going through the trouble of scouring the whole planet and all the time that it took... You know, you might get 10 or 15 POIs that were actually interesting and, and um, they really just kind of need to go through and rework all those POIs to make it to where they're a lot more challenging. Some of them are really good. Don't get me wrong. Some of them are really good. But um, I would say out of the 300 or so that they got, you know, maybe 25 are good. And then 150 are like, meh, meh. And then a 50 50 to 75 are just placeholders. They, they're a lot of those uh, ancient runes, you know, concrete runes. They just really need, you know, um, to 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 go back and revisit. You know, hire a couple of guys, or uh, really really lean on the community. You know, inter integrated into the Steam Workshop to where um, the community can can build some of these these POIs, and then maybe maybe every um, you know, twice a year, do a server wipe and a reboot, to where they can re can reintegrate some and update these POIs. Because I don't think you can update POIs once the server goes live. Um, but I, I think that would help the game so much. Is that that con that content of um, fighting those fights and then and then with those POIs, you get you know unique recipes out of the the factions. Like the flamethrower comes from the Xerax and the the uh, you know certain thruster technology comes from the Creel. Server sort of hovercraft technology comes from. I'm just making shit up. You know, I'm just making stuff up. But uh, certain 
thruster or hovercraft technology comes from, um, you know, the uh, the trading faction, and you can buy that stuff, or you buy those blue plants, but you have to kill the car uh, the Creel to get the thruster technology, you know, and you have to, or maybe you have to do like a trading thing where, you know, you have to get a certain rep and do a certain kind of deals, trading deals with the NPCs and just, you know, and, and also the kind of the rework of the playability loop that I've talked about pretty extensively in the past. All, all that stuff needs to be revisited. Oh man, I don't, like, there's no point in hanging out here anymore. I don't know what to do with this. Um... I really just need to salvage this thing, and I I do wish that they had a uh, a salvage all. Like I wish there was a reclaim structure icon in here in the control panel where I could just be I could just be like under logistics, right? Uh, no, that's logic. I'm sorry, devices. Mm, maybe under device main. Where there was some button, maybe over here, another tab, uh, and I could just reclaim all the materials in this structure so I could pack this thing up. And it's okay if it's at a 30% loss or 40%, whatever the reclaim statistic is, that's fine. And just reclaim all of this stuff back into the uh, workshop, and I can just pack up and take it somewhere else because some of these... Um, you know, and I've already kind of spent a lot of time in the creative mode reworking all of these. So that was kind of another issue that I was having. Um, oh, man. I didn't realize when I pressed those hotkeys what I was doing. All right. As always, thanks for watching. I appreciate all the feedback. Um, yeah, I'm going to end the video here. All right.